That's right, Brett. Oklahoma is one of at least three states to receive a letter like this. It's just not something we could we could accommodate. Brian Dean with the Oklahoma State Election Board says the letter from Russia stipulates the officer would be present for a short period of time when convenient with the goal of studying the U.S. experience. Specifically asked to be present at, at ballot stations and that is just not allowed by state law and that's not allowed for anybody foreign or domestic. If the Oklahoma Secretary of State responded with a letter of his own saying it is prohibited under state law to allow anyone except election officials and voters in or around the area. Dean says the U.S. State Department has made similar requests before on behalf of other countries, but this is the first time in recent history that a country has reached out directly to the state of Oklahoma. We have been requested in the past to to, you know, have watchers from that program, but we've always had to turn them down as well. The U.S. State Department has been notified about the situation and they are continuing to monitor it. Reporting live at the state capitol, Kelsey Powell, KOCO 5 News.